Hello and welcome to my channel, Love and Wonders Tarot. This is a reading for Scorpio. Scorpio, this is your about last night reading where we take a look at your romantic situation and try to determine what's going on. Today I'm using my Light Sears Tarot deck along with my This Might Hurt Tarot deck. And as you can see, I've already meditated, shuffled, and pulled your cards. All of my cards are read in the upright position. So let's get started, Scorpio. Okay, Scorpio, today this side represents you. This side represents your person. We're going to take a look at you. You have the Eight of Cups. You have the Four of Wands. You have the Two of Cups. And you have the Magician. So let's see what's going on. I feel like, okay, we're going to start with the Eight of Cups. So with the Eight of Cups, I feel like you are um, in the process of leaving or walking away from a situation. Okay, so maybe the situation, in your opinion, is no longer serving you, so you're, you're leaving. You've already left or you're, you're thinking about leaving, okay? But there's a Four of Wands. So the Four of Wands, this is celebrations. This is uh, marriage, okay? This is the marriage card. So I feel like you're either walking away from a marriage or maybe you are saying that you don't want to get married so maybe you're supposed to get married maybe you're engaged and you're walking away from that let's see if, what else we can find out all right so you do have the two of cups so the two of cups is all about that perfect partnership right your soulmate the one that you love so um but you do have the eight of cups so walking away from this person so you know what i'm getting scorpio i'm getting that i feel that you want to get married to someone and i feel like you're telling this person if you don't marry me i'm gonna leave okay i'm gonna leave and find someone who wants to marry me i'm gonna leave because i can do better with the two of cups this is thinking that you're with the person that you're supposed to be with but maybe you feel like this is not the person, the perfect match for you, and you can do better. That's what I'm feeling. I'm feeling, yeah, that you want this person, you want to get married to this person, but something's happening and you're threatening to walk away, and I feel, and manifest someone else. I feel like you're telling someone else, I can get, I can do better. I can get someone who will appreciate me, okay? I'm ready to start something new. So that's, yeah, that's truly what I feel, Scorpio, that you're with someone and they're not you've been together maybe for a while and they don't want to get married and so you're saying you know what if you don't want to get married i'm gonna go ahead and leave because i'm gonna go ahead and find someone else who will marry me okay that's what i'm getting let's look at your person your person has the two of pentacles the tower okay your person has oops, the nine of pentacles and finally, the Page of Wands. So, I think I'm seeing it here. So, the pressure. Okay, so, I feel like your person feels forced. So, with the Tower, this is a forced ending of something, a forced decision, okay? Something that you have to do quickly, all right? So, that's what I feel. I feel like your person is uh, forced to choose between something with this... Um, Two of Pentacles. Your person is forced to choose between two things. And I feel like your person maybe works a lot. I don't feel like this is, you know, a choice between another person. Your person has someone else that they're dealing with. I feel like they work a lot. Your person, I feel like this is your person, the Nine of Pentacles is showing up as the Nine of Pentacles energy. So I feel like your person just works a lot. And your person is single and maybe your person is taking their time about making that commitment okay that's what i feel i feel like your person is enjoying being single right now being single and you know with the page of wands so this person might be a little bit younger or have a little bit more immature energy likes to have a lot of fun but is not really committing this person likes you you have a good time when you're around this person you know sex is good and all of that stuff but the person just is not ready yeah, I do feel, and maybe, you know, maybe your person is like finishing up their education or something like this. Something to do with their money, okay? So your person is having a hard time balancing this connection with their their money or their school or something like that. And I feel like your person feels pressured to make a decision. The bottom of the deck for you, Scorpio, is the Knight of Pentacles. So this is how you feel. You feel 
that your person just, it's not going anywhere. You've been in this connection. Okay, there, here's the threat. I'm, I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave because this connection is not going anywhere, okay? I thought that we would at least be married by now. Maybe I can go off, be single, and start dating and having fun, okay? That's what that could mean too. Again, I feel like you feel like, you know, you're in love with this person, but I feel like there's something being said like, you know, I can go ahead and get someone else. I can get someone else who will marry me, okay? Let's see what's on the bottom of the deck for your person. The bottom of the deck for your person is the Eight of Wands. So this means, this this could go with your person feeling pressured, okay? Like thinking that things are moving fast or, um, it could also mean that there's a change about to happen. So things will start going in your favor, you know, once you make this threat to to uh, walk away. So this is more fast movement. So I feel like your person, ooh, the, the next card down is the judgment. So I do feel like, yeah, your person is thinking about, okay, what's gonna happen if, you know, he or she leaves me, what can I do better? This is evaluating and auditing yourself, trying to figure out, okay, what, what role did I play in this, okay? Uh, judgment is also about, I feel like a soulmate card as well. I believe this is a soulmate card as well. The next card, the next card down is the six of wands. So this person, I, I do feel like this person does like you. This person just, you know, maybe when you tell your person, I'm going to leave, they're, they're, they're going to be like, no, you know, I want to have a victory. I, I, I do want Scorpio. So I feel like your person's going to make a quick decision here pretty soon. But, you know, it, maybe you're doing the right thing by saying, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and leave if you don't want to take this to another level. We've been together long enough to be married. Um, so that's what I'm getting, you know, for some of my Scorpios today. Um, yeah, your person is, yeah, gonna, there's going to be a big change, a sudden change, okay, with this Tower card. A sudden change. I feel like your person feels forced, but your your person is going to be forced to make a decision and there's going to be a big change. So good luck when it comes to that Scorpio. All right. So thank you for stopping by and watching my video and have a wonderful day.